Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Before we get started, have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button on my main page. And once you have done this, don't forget to click on that bell to be the first to get notified when I upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you a couple of ways to stop a Roblox from crashing. I have been asked by a few people, why does my Roblox game keep crashing all the time? There could be a few things that are causing a Roblox to crash. The first step we are going to take is making sure our Windows is up to date. You need to head on down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and type in Windows Update. You now need to click on Check for Updates. And we now need to click on Check for Updates, just to make sure our machine is completely up to date. And as you can see, my machine is up to date, which is great. That means that that is not a issue. The next step is to go back down to the bottom left hand corner of our screen. And we now need to type in firewall. And we want to click on allow an app through Windows firewall. And we now want to click on change settings. And we want to click on allow another app. And you now need to click on browse. And we now need to go to our C drive. And we want to go to users. You now need to click on your username. And you need to scroll all the way down until you see app data. If you cannot see app data, then you need to simply open up File Explorer quickly. You now need to click on view. And you need to go across to options. We now need to click on view. And you need to click on show hidden files, folders and drives. And this will allow us to view the app data folder as it is a hidden folder. Once you're finished doing that, we need to go back to our firewall and we need to click on app data. You now need to go to local and we need to look for Roblox. And once you've found Roblox, you now need to open up that folder and we now need to click on versions. And we need to click on the latest version at the top here. And we now need to double click on Roblox Player Beta. And once you've done that, we can now go Add. And you now need to just click on Public as well. And we now need to go OK. And what that has done is added Roblox to our firewall, basically saying it's fine to have this program connect to the internet. Now open up Roblox and give it another try. If it's still not working, then the next step is to head on over to your graphics card manufacturer website. I've got an Infidia graphics card, so I need to go to Infidia. And you need to download the latest graphics drivers for your machine. Once you've finished doing that, you now need to click on the link that's in the description below. And you will end up on a page that looks like this. You now need to go ahead and press download. And you want to untick these two boxes if they're ticked. And you want to go no thanks and continue. You now need to go save file. And we want to run the setup file. You want to go I accept. Next. We don't want to install the Bing bar. And we need to go next again. And what it's doing now is making sure we have the latest version of DirectX. And if we don't, then it will go ahead and install DirectX. Once you have finished installing the latest graphics card drivers and also installing DirectX, give Roblox another try to see if it works. You may need to restart your computer after installing the graphics card drivers. If you are still having problems with Roblox, then the next step is to make sure your antivirus program is not causing the problems. So you want to go ahead and disable your antivirus and try and launch Roblox. If that still hasn't helped, then there's one more thing we can try and do, and that is to open up your web browser. And if you're using Firefox, you need to go to the top right hand corner and you need to click on add-ons. On any other web browser, you need to go to your add-ons manager. And we basically want to disable any add-ons we have. For example, here I have ad blocker and also I have a YouTube video downloader. I want to go ahead and disable these as they could be causing the issue with Roblox as well. And that is it for this video. 
if you still are having problems with Roblox, then it may be you have to uninstall the program. And to do that, all you need to do is go onto your file explorer and you now need to go to your C drive and we want to go to users and we need to click onto our username and you now need to go to app data, local and you now need to find Roblox and you simply need to right click on Roblox and press delete. And we just want to delete the folder and then try launching Roblox again and it will reinstall the game. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.